Hi everyone, it's time for Strong Towers again. Hi everybody, how are you? Okay, should we start with saying good morning properly? You ready? Good morning, Strong Towers. And good morning, God. And God, we pray that you'd be with us today and that we'd have lots of fun together learning all about you. Amen. Right. Hey, Froggy, do you like my, my strong tower that I built? It's very tall. Look, it's almost reaching to the ceiling. I'm going to see if I can put some more bricks on it and see if I can make it even taller. Look, let's see. Got to be really careful now that I don't knock it down. Wow, it is getting very, very tall. Let's see if I can get another one on. Oh, brilliant. Oh, I've run out of bricks. I'll have to do it again later. What was that, Froggy? You can see something sticking out of the tower. I wonder what it is. Shall we have a look? Oh, it is the secret sign. Let's pick it up. Careful, don't knock the... <laughs> Tower's fallen down. I'm gonna to have to start all over again. And I was sure I could reach the ceiling. Oh well, I'll have to try again later. Let's read what the secret sign says. It says, God is greater than we are. Now we're gonna learn read a story about God being greater than we are and about a strong tower. Um, and after that, then we'll teach the secret sign to all the animals. So do you remember last time we learned all about Noah's Ark and the flood? Well, this story is from just after that. So after the flood, everyone talked the same language so everyone could understand each other. And that made life really easy and it meant that they could work together, which was quite a good thing. Now, one day, the people decided that they were going to build a tower and work together to build a brilliant tower. So they started off building and building it took them a long time, but they were working together really well. And their tower was getting really, really tall. I don't know if I can build mine up tall enough for you to see in time. But when it got quite tall, they started to boast. And they were started to get a bit silly. Because they started saying, oh, aren't we clever? We're cleverer than God is. We don't need God anymore. We can build such tall towers. Aren't we amazing? We don't need God. And do you know what? They did need God. And God knew that. And he was quite upset that they were saying that they didn't need him anymore. So he came up with a plan. But you can see my tower now. It is getting a little bit taller again. But I think I'll have to finish it later. Um, so God had a plan. And he decided that... He was going to change the way that people talked and then they wouldn't be able to understand each other and they'd realise that they needed him. So, some people started talking in new strange languages. Some people said, wibble, 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 wibble. Everyone looked at them and said, what was that you were saying? And then, wibble, 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 wibble. I don't know what you mean. Tell me again. Wibble, 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 wibble. And then another person started going, doopy, 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 doop. And the other one went, -ibble 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 -ibble. and then someone else started going, rhubarb, 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 rhubarb. And no one could understand each other. The languages were all mixed up. And the people gave up building their tower. They couldn't make it work because they couldn't talk to each other. They were all confused. And they just went off and went away and spread out all over the place. So that tower became known as Babel because when they were talking all strange new languages that no one understood it sounded like they were babbling a bit so anyway then they realized they did need God and they weren't greater than him so let's practice our secret sign are you ready froggy I think he is so we're going to go God is greater than we are Okay, I think first of all, we're going to tell the giraffes because I've got giraffes on my t-shirt. Are you ready? Stretch up your neck tall. God is greater than we are. And let's 
um, tell the crocodiles. Get your crocodile. Snap, snap. God is greater than we are. And let's tell some lions. Are you ready? God is greater than we are. And should we tell a dinosaur? Are you ready? Stomp, stomp. God is greater than we are. And should we tell something small? Let's tell a goldfish. You do a blub, 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 like a fish. Blub, blub. God is greater than we are. And shall we tell some little buzzy flies? Can you hear? God is greater than we are. And last of all, let's find those ants crawling in the cracks. God is greater than we are. Brilliant. Well done. Right. Now, it's time for me to say goodbye in a minute, but you could have a go at building a really tall tower. See if you can build one nearly up to the ceiling or taller than you are. That would be amazing. You could build it from all sorts of different things. Um, and then you could ask your family to have a look at the sheet with all the different crafts on and see if there's anything there that you'd like to have a go at making as well. Um, right. So I pray that you'd have a great time today and um, learn lots about God and enjoy being with your family. And I will see you again next week. Bye-bye.